Today is probably going to run a bit longer than I normally like to have it because I want to get all three Protoss missions done. Zeratul, your paranoia is showing. All right, Zeratul, old buddy, you got your mysterious prophecy. Now let's see what your preservers made of it. My quest to decipher the prophecy took me to the forbidden archive world of Zakun. Preservers guarded ancient knowledge. Knowledge? Only they could transcribe the prophetic fragments. I needed to seek them out quickly. I just realized those three guys got immortality and got stuck with a librarian job. Yikes. Don't get me wrong, it's nothing against librarians or libraries, but to have that be your immortality, your entire eternal existence. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know about that. Especially if you have to deal with people constantly trying to check in and check out books. No, thank you. Look at those probes just sitting there. They know they're the most OP unit. Probes. Okay. Get some pylons down. Remember my strategy for these Protoss missions to adhere to a bad versus brutal paradigm is to use gateway units only. Because immortals are too good. The mighty spirits of the preservers are in prison close by. We must find them. I really expect in utter darkness to be the only challenge for this. This mission especially can be beaten with gateway units pretty easily. The next one, I, I'm going to be sad that I don't have Colossi, but I think I can make it work. In Utter Darkness, he's going to be a whole different beast. Going to need a lot of storm. These Protoss are listed as Zakul Guardians, but they serve the hybrid. Are they Taldarim? I don't think so. I don't think these are Taldarim. They're just a different sect of Protoss that got hybrided. I can't take it seriously with the Brood War Terran music. It's too good. 
Don't mind me. Alright, Brenna, I'll just be over here vibing. Thank you. Do I get a free immortal? I don't remember. He says, a robotics facility. This structure may prove useful to us. Not to me, it won't. This knowledge is forbidden. Shoot the Archon. Do get a free one. All right. My thanks, mighty one. Well, now this mission's gonna be easy. I get one immortal. Excuse me. cannons on each side. I don't know if I have enough to be pushing this side actually, but I want to try it. Oh, no, I just lost an Archon. And I'm about to lose my second one. No. 500 gas down the toilet. There's the fourth. A right. couple more archons. Try and keep the immortal alive if I can. 
The damage to buildings is too valuable. That's okay timing, actually. I can just stop this attack right here. Oh, I need to cut probe production. I'm at tw 23 probes on minerals. Two archons? That's fine. That's okay. I went full gold league and put four cannons there. Get him. Definite. It's important. Oh, hang on. It is important, as you're going through this mission, to remember to keep one High Templar on a control group for feedback. Since Mar uses energy, he is a spellcaster, you can zap his energy, deal damage to him, and prevent him from using any of his spells. Sounds pretty useful, right? There's your tip. There's your... Feedback. Ah, you're so funny. I know. Thank you. There we go. Should be okay. 
stalkers are quite bad. I still got the immortal. Living up to his name. So now it's just build up an army, and then I can go. I've got eight gates, which is plenty for the economy I'm on. Might even be a little too much. I can just barely support it. Not too much more, I believe. I know they have they have voiders, they have carriers, and they'll have Mar. I should probably wait until after the next Mar attack. Hello, random archons. Demanding. I am here in the shadows. You require my skills. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait one more. Cause I'm a pansy like that. at your size storm. This was actually pretty easy. I think I had more than enough. <laughs> Guys, the immortal is still here. I 
I got one immortal, and I'm gonna end it with one immortal. Beautiful. great hunger well it could either be the overmind or me at dinner time I have to see which one it is did I get anything good I know the the biggest benefit to this is all the research but uh, oh I did I did get the uh, command center reactor oh the zerg stuff too all right Gotta take care of this right now. ASAP. I like goodies. So, Predator. I believe I'm supposed to have the Predator and the Command Center Reactor to get two SCVs at the same time. This one actually seems like it, it could be enjoyable. I don't normally ever go with it. I normally only go with the automated refinery, but I'm open to it. I return to our ruined home of Iron. The fur infestation still cover much of our mm -hmm. world. Mm -hmm. The The desiccated remains. How long has it been in the timeline? Four years? That Overmind's body is probably quite decomposed at this point. At the very apex of its victory against us, the Zerg Overmind grew. left of the mighty overmind was a twisted, withered husk. I needed to understand whatever memories lingered within the creature's rotting mass. Only by making contact with the gargantuan tendrils connected directly to its cortex could I learn its secrets. Yet its countless minions, which seem to be feeding from its dead husk, would prove somewhat problematic. Why? Why are they eating it? Ugh. <laughs> point one is why are they eating it? And point two is why did I need to know that? That doesn't change anything. Functional. We shall make use of them. 
Zeratul is so lucky. He just keeps finding bases. No, they're just hungry, because they're fading from it. Oh, that's not nice. So I get two Colossi. Probably best to just leave them for defense, though. Use them wisely. Yeah, right. Dude, I'm so not doing that. YOLO, charge, bullet. Zeratul gets hit. He says disaster is imminent. get anything done over here. There's a spore. the ultra slightly harass the ultralisk make him think he's getting hit by a piece of paper Broodlord. Broodlord saw me. Oh, I still need a Twilight. What? 50? Oh, this inflation. Mm -hmm. 
I got 30 seconds on the attack. I guess I probably should have used my Void Prison on that. Probably would have been a good idea. Vulcan mind melding with it. That's not weird at all. That's an awful fate that I can think of. To be trapped within one of the gates and it gets shut off. Like, what happens? Are you just stuck in limbo? Welcome to the void? That's an awful thought. Saved the Archon. I don't know why I find this so funny, but I do. 
Zeratul gets hit with anything, he starts screaming disaster. I should have worked those in over here. All is in jeopardy. All is in jeopardy. Disaster is imminent. Death and joy. Joy in death? here. The Zerg are coming. The Zerg are coming. Oh, don't run into Banes, guys. Jeez. What a good timing, plus two just finished. It's almost like I knew that was happening, but I didn't, because you guys know I'm not that good. I'm mildly confident. I knew I started plus two, I just didn't know when it finished. I do have this base that I could take in the upper right, but I don't think I need it. Is 
Hey, there's another one. The mission is in peril. No, Zeratul. You are. You are in peril. You address me, Steve. I will be We justice. Disaster is imminent. It gets me. Alright. Let's finish this up. That's actually quite a bit. Quite a bit of Zerg. Just need to bring everybody together here. We are the blades of Get shot by a bird lord. Easy peasy. Archons are too good. Ow, oh, guys. Greetings, brother. I speak to you from the beyond. Tassadar. But you died. Slay this cursed overmind. That's pretty sad, actually. That's a sad thought. Who did this? Why? I know not, but the Overmind found a way to resist its all-consuming directive. It created a chance, a hope of salvation. Giant egg. Oh, oh, it's Kerrig. Madness. Madness. This is Sparta. Only she can free the serve from sin. And in so doing, save all that is from the flame. I do not understand, brother. Forget what you know, sir. Just forget everything you know. No, 
and then it'll make sense. I cannot bear it. Stop. I have something to tell you, and I need you to trust me on it. Just don't think about anything else, anything you've ever learned, or anything that makes sense. And then you should be fine. Little sus. Little bit suspicious. Alright. In utter darkness. Oh, can get my my next Zerg research. I want to say it's regenerative biosteel because cellular reactor is what I normally go with. It's too good. Too good. Go with biosteel instead. All right. That uh, so that leaves Psi Disruptor for the last one on the Zerg side, and then on Protoss it'll be Raven and the Orbital Strike. Okay, I think I need a minute before I go into In Utter Darkness, which is sure to be an absolute ton of fun with no Stargate or Robo units. I'm sure editor Alarak will remember to edit this minute out. While I'm gone, I'll leave you with this wonderful Zerg picture. Fine. All right, let's do this. In utter darkness, building gateway only. I don't think I want to see any vision of the Overlands. But if Kerrigan's involved, I need to know. I'm going to need a lot of Storm and Archons. On a distant shattered world, the Protoss will make their final stand. Their heroes will gather. Their forces will be marshaled, and they will die bravely. But still, they will die. And my Zerg will be slaves to the high women. All will bow before the power mm. of the fallen one. Slavery's not cool, man. I have two thoughts about this initially. One is I'm gonna have to do the DT bridge strat. And the second is that's going to end quicker than normal because I'm not building any Stargate units, so I can't hunt down the Overseers as quickly or as efficiently. So I'm gonna make a lot of DTs and then try not to lose them. Gosh, I get two Colossi. I do not want to have to think about how this would go with zero. I do get quite a bit of free units from the portal, too. Might get a few good ones, like Immortals or Carriers. How can you not respect the Protoss with that kind of sentiment? Those that follow, may they find our knowledge and not repeat our mistakes. That's, just, that's a high five kind of statement.
triple forge. Indigos, you're so bad. Did you really go three forge? Yes, yes I did. I don't know if I'll use it. For those that do not know what I'm doing here, placing the DTs in a wall and putting them on hold position so that the Zerg cannot get through without detectors. It won't work forever, but it'll, it'll work for now. Why do I have the observers here? Oh, I all armied at the start, of course. I forgot I did that. That one should be set. start. Having to devote everything into the DTs means my army is not growing. I can only hope that it'll buy me enough time to go into High Templar, get, get Archons, get Storm, start building cannons. enough. It's funny. It's funny. They they're stopping in front of the DTs and then going around. Up. 
All right, I, I think that's better. Maybe. Stalker, Stalker can't get through, but Stalker's pretty thick. Might not be indicative. are a problem. You have not enough minerals. Our void rays are ready to do their work. Disengage prison rays and concentrate all the batteries on the hive. Well met, Greek Mohanda. Four iron. Got the voids. The OP rays. Everything's holding for now. Still no overseers. Once they start bringing overseers, this gets a bit tougher. I'm inclined to try to not warp in too many zealots. Minerals should instead be spent on cannons. That's not a wall. Okay. It's enough, though. It's enough of a wall. I should spend the gas on Archons, High Templar, and Upgrades, and the rest of the minerals should go into cannons. Overseer. I lost every DT. Damn. This is going to be rough. I can't kill the Overseer quickly. I have to defend this low ground for 10 minutes for the research. That's a long time to not have the DT wall. Destruction. 
I like it. I like your puns, villain man. Immortals. I was just over here too. Get him out. Get him out. Seven, seven minutes to go, jeez. I'd really like the research. I killed myself trying to defend this low ground. Get him out. Just get him out of there. It's not worth it. Boy, zealots aren't even really worth it. The zealots are just a front line fodder. That's a lot of Archons. That's a, that's a good Protoss army. You build that in multiplayer, you know somebody's gonna have a bad day. I got eight Storm Templar. And way too many Archons. No, I take that back. There's never too many Archons. Gosh, almost the entire first page of my army is Archons. It's 
Oh yeah, you two got this. Archon Immortal versus Hybrid. I trust them. Oh my word, the storms do nothing to the hybrid. Barely tickle them. Oh, by Zeratul. doing less than a minute on the uh, research that's good 1600 kills out of 2500 making progress it looks like I will be good for the research which means I can retreat to the high ground when I need it Just gotta get the Templar out. Losing the low ground. 1742 kills. It's a lot of Zerg. The Archons are tripping over each other. I'm, supply, I'm about to be supply blocked, which is a very bad thing. That is very, very bad. That means I've lost a lot of pylons. Am I going to be able to do this? Almost 1900, this means I got to kill 600 Zerg. With not a lot of army.
Losing control. Save me, Artana. some time with a vortex base is going down armies going down just do what you can I'm down to only air units 2486 come on just kill eight things you guys can do it Alright, good, good. That's it, the mission's won. Oh, man. Kerrigan. How could we have known? Wow, this is over. Yeah, this is over. This is beyond over. Investing into gateway units only, it can do the job. Is this it? Is this where I die? Right, right on the cusp. That's fine. I think the observer's gonna live though. Just a hunch. Bye bye, Artanis. Bye bye, Solendus. Bye bye, carrier. Oh, they got the observer. How could you? Monsters. And this is why StarCraft has a gore rating. Has blood. Terran Miller. All right, it can be done. It's not clean. It's not pretty. Well, the storms are kind of pretty, but you know what I mean. You can beat all of those Protoss missions producing only gateway units. In Utter Darkness is really the only one that was close. Of all that we know. 
Draenor, you may soon hold Kerrigan's fate in your hands. I know only that she must live. Be wary, old friend. The hounds of the void are on the hunt. And that is going to wrap up today's episode. It was an action-packed and exciting few battles. In Utter Darkness is such a fun mission. Hey, I get ravens. Okay. Get this raven research. And then next time, I can return to the Terran missions. Yeah. Auto turret's always quite good. So, as I said, next time be picking it back up with the Terran missions using the list of bad units only that have been pre-approved. Haven Tarsonis or Tirador. Now that's something to think on. You can think on it too. Have a great day.